Okay, so we got uh, these little kits here that we ordered off Amazon. Um, they can be used for many different things, but it's basically a, a switchboard. Um, these ones are gonna be used to open up a garage door. Um, they come with uh, four channels. The one, I bought another one that was the same, except it only had two relays on it, so two channel. And they're fairly simple to set up. The, uh, when you buy them, you get the module, um, the remotes, and some instructions that don't tell you a whole lot, but it's just enough. Um, they do not come with a 12 volt power supply. I picked these up from uh, Restore and it was like two bucks. So this just gives you, uh, turns your 120 volt AC into a 12 volt DC half, uh, power supply. Half an amp. Yep. So I'm going to use my multimeter and end up figuring out which one's positive and which one's negative. I forget. I'm pretty sure positive is the one that has the dots on it, but I like to just double check to make sure. So yeah, you can see on the board here, you've got your power in and that's going to feed the coil side of all the relays. And then on the switch side, you'll notice that you have three possible inputs per relay. So this is going to dictate whether you have it wired up for normally open or a normally closed relay. And basically it would be, you know, your, your circuit's gonna go into A and then if it was normally open, it would go into B and if it was normally closed, it would go into C. I'm not sure if it's in that orientation. I'm gonna have to take my multimeter and check it and figure it out. Um, just from skimming over the instructions, it actually doesn't tell you which one's normally open and normally closed, which is sort of stupid. The, uh, the other one that I bought, it did have a nicer little instruction booklet that told you that. And the board itself was printed NC and NO, so you knew it was normally closed or normally open. But uh, yeah, there's a part number there. It could be used for many different things, like uh, if you needed to control, there's pretty much anything electrical. If you had uh Trying to think of something. Garage door is a good way, though. Yeah, garage door is a good way. So I'm, we actually, uh, well, I'm going to use it for two doors. So that's why I got the four channel. So A would be up. I'm going to make C down. B is up and D is down. And uh, basically all I'm going to do here is bench test it and then write down what does what. So that it's not A is up and D is down for one door. So pretty much just going to strip this back put it in to the board of the right polarity and then i'll just use my meter and stick it in the first one and record what does this with what bu button push and then just record it all out and uh, wire it up that way so i thought it was pretty interesting uh, if you got any comments or questions uh, let me know in the comments below and uh, thanks for checking it out